Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. I'm gonna do a mixed drink. And I just recently um, reviewed this ginger beer, and it has a uh, a uh, ingredient or a um, recipe for a drink called a Moscow Mule, which is a popular drink. Um, uh, with this Powell and Mahoney ginger beer. It says take four ounces of Powell and Mahoney original ginger beer, 1.5 ounces of vodka, stir well, and garnish with a slice of lime and serve over ice. Okay, so um, I think I got what I need here to accomplish this. Um, so let's let's start by getting our uh, our ginger beer in here. Authentic ways of making drinks is to mix it in one cup and then pour it over the ice, I, I think. Um, but I'm just going to do it this way. Um, I think it should be all right. Um, it's 1.5 ounces. I measured it out. It's one shot, a regular shot glass like this. Um, just a basic shot glass of vodka. Okay, stir up this little knife I used to cut and slice the limes with. Okay, let's put this ice in there. Doesn't really fill the glass up. It's probably made for more of a, a drink a drink glass, which is a lot smaller. Um, but uh, here. That kind of gave it a little bit extra stir, right? So, all right, so here's, there it is. Moscow Mule. Pretty simple. Um, still is a little low on the glass. I, maybe drink glasses like this come in different sizes. I mean, I don't know. Okay, well, let's see what we got. Getting the burn from the ginger, getting the the vodka in there a little bit. Um, it's it's pretty good. Seems like it's missing something. I don't know why, but maybe it's missing a better a better better vodka. This is a cheap vodka. Maybe a better vodka would make the difference. Um, but let's just see if, let's just see if our garnish makes any difference. If I put some lime in there, I don't know, it just seems, it seemed kind of boring, so I just, I don't know. This wasn't standing out to me enough. Just use up the whole lime. I need to use up these limes. They're starting to look a little sad. Yeah, let's just go with that. All right. 
Let's see what that did. That made a lot of difference. A little zing, a little zing, and a little zang. <laughs> uh, that 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 lime. I haven't been saying lemon, have I? I don't know. Um, that lime made a little more difference um, to it. Um, I think for me, the glass wasn't all the way full, so I think instead of four ounces of the ginger beer, I would say go ahead and fill fill it up a little bit further um, and add some limes. Instead of them just being a garnish, actually add some limes in there. Maybe a little, maybe a little squirt of, of lime juice or something. Um, but that's just me. Um, I, I went by the directions and the only thing that I can think of that might have made the difference was that this cheap vodka. Um, because I did everything in here that it said. <clears throat> I don't know. That tastes better to me now. Um, the way it was, it seemed like the ginger beer was a little diluted out um, from that shot of vodka and the, and the ice. But uh, adding the lime to it and a little bit more ginger beer, for me, it made a difference. So, so there you go. I mean, let me know. If, I mean, I know there's different ways of making the Moscow mules. Um, this is just their way of doing it. Um, but uh, that's just, just my opinion. All right. Well, I'm going to end it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. This here is the Powell and Mahoney Craft Cocktail Mixers Ginger Beer. Is what I what I used and I reviewed this by itself. And it's a good ginger beer. Um, yeah, I enjoyed it. Okay, well, yeah, thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it, and we will see you on the next one. All right, bye.